going to show you some simple carvings today with these pumpkins which you can do at home with simple carving tools. This is a large pumpkin and it is really interesting shape. It's quite broad at the top so I'm going to use it as a face and the stock end will be the nose. Take a marker and carefully draw the eyes. Make them big and as round as possible. Draw on some eyebrows too. For the mouth, I'm drawing a simple crescent moon shape. On the bottom of the pumpkin, draw a large circle and this will be the bit we cut out to scoop out the insides. First though, I want this pumpkin to stand up properly, making the most of the shape. So we need to cut the section from the bottom that will allow it to rest properly. Now when you are carving the pumpkin, I think the best knife to use is a simple paring knife. The curved edge really helps slice through the tough outer layer. It's also easier to guide the blade along the markings. Carefully remove the back opening and scoop out as much of the flesh and seeds as you can. Slice away the excess from the back piece. This will help you when you place it back on the finished pumpkin. Carefully run the blade along the circle of the eye. Then scrape out the thin layer of the skin all the way around. Now score a smaller circle inside the eye and this will be the pumpkin's pupil. From here you want to cut away the outer section around the pupil. You can always tidy up as you go if you don't get exactly right. Do exactly the same process for the other eye. Carve out the eyebrows taking care not to make them big or uneven. Finally we are going to carve the mouth. Lay the pumpkin on its back so it's as easy as possible to carve. Remove the section and then clean up the edges by slicing a small bevel along the cut. This will make your pumpkin really stand out. Do a last tidy up and then replace the back and it's ready to use. So there we go, just few simple steps and you have a great result.